But the apocalypse is upon us. Unfortunately, it's also time for our father-son yearly trip. So to the bunker they go, can Ted and Timmy survive a nuclear fallout? Let's find out. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Timmy! Get in there, Timmy! Okay, okay, okay. Little boy's in, little boy's in. Let me grab that, let me grab that, and... Can I pick that up? Shit, no, I can't yet. Move! All in there. Oh, I gotta get the gun. Where's the gun? The gun's on the other side? Yes. Give me that. Uh, what else can I grab? What else can I grab? Oh, there was water. Water, 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 water. Come on. Okay, okay. Get in there. Uh, sorry, babe. Not today. Come on. Come on. Pick it up! Damn it! Uh, uh, give me the water. Okay, okay. Oh my god, I'm so running out of time. Uh, uh, okay. There's all that. Now I definitely need the gas mask. We got the checkerboard. Uh, 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 where's, uh, shit, shit, shit. What else we got? Sorry, 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 Big Bertha. Not today, bitch. What else, what else, what else, what else? Oh, shit. Nope, no, no time, no time, no time. Get to cover! Oh, that was close. Okay, day one. With me and Timmy. Okay, how much how much do I grab? I got four water, four, five, six soup. Uh good soup. Uh I got Boy Scout book had to have already been here. Uh the axe. Did we grab the axe? Yeah, we grabbed the axe. Definitely the gun. We grabbed the gun, grabbed the checkers. I think, I'm assuming that stuff was already here. Uh, and I made sure to grab the gas mask and the med kit. Cause my first playthrough desperately needed both of those. Uh, I'm upset. I kinda wish I grabbed the radio. I just <laughs> I just did not think about it. Here we go. Timmy is safe. And that's what matters. We barely got in here by... Uh, we got barely got in here. We barely got in here. I... This is the problem. I can't read. We barely got here in time ourselves. We have no idea what happened to Mary Jane and Dolores. I don't know. Who cares? Fuck them. Uh, maybe they're okay. When we opened the shelter door, we noticed some of, of, of the shelves were already stocked. We can't wait. We can't really say... We recall putting all of these supplies here, but we're definitely going to put them to good use. One harmonica, one deck of cards, and one Boy Scout book. Our shows are full of cans. We'll eat from cans. Uh, we'll sleep on cans. We'll even talk to cans. Some of us already do. <laughs> little Timmy. Uh, there's just barely enough water for everyone. We have. We will have to ration it strictly. What do you mean? There's a shit ton of soup. How much soup? No. What do we got? Look at all the soup we got. Tell me we got a ration? Bullshit. One minute it was all fine, and the next we were at each other's throats. How did this happen? This is insane. We need to get a grip on us. Dude, this is like the first hour. What is that? Oh, okay, I guess we're, we're drawing a tank. Alright then. Day two. Okay, oh, to look at Timmy. <laughs> Go, little boy, Timmy. Did is some of our food gone? What was that? We could barely sleep after all that arguing. Let's hope this won't happen again. Ted is fine. Despite the dire circumstances and all that trouble we are going through, Timmy is being very brave. Oh, good for you, little Timmy. Uh, I think I think they have I think they're good. Uh contamination of our town is still strong. Scavenging in these conditions could result in radiation sickness. Yeah, I'm gonna hold off for now. We felt like something was staring at us from the corner of the shelter. We think it's a rat. At least, it looks like a rat. A rat on a very good diet. We decided we need something to do, we need to do something about it. Or to put it more blunt, bluntly, it's either him or, uh, fuck, kill the damn thing. I don't give a shit. As long as me and Timmy stay alive. Ted and Timmy, best friends for life. Uh, whatever it was, it's dead now. Quite dead. Maybe there's more hiding somewhere in one of those nasty little holes. Ted needs water to survive. How about getting Timmy something to drink? He's not looking for fine. Damn. Waterfall. Our neighborhood is still highly radioactive. Trips to the surface are a big risk to our health right now. Yeah, I don't want to deal with any of that right now. This is insane. We keep finding spiders everywhere. They're in our soup. Good soup. They're in our water. Nice. Uh, we swear some of them keep coming back. And they're bigger every time we see them. It can't go on like this. It's time to wage war on these spiders. Uh, I guess the Boy Scout book. Ah, oh, the bug spray. 
the hell we're gonna use a med kit for? Patch him up, make him even stronger, stronger than before. Power Rangers Zeo style. Damn. Uh, okay, books are Okay, now we're chilling. Uh, we were all. We always knew books were precious. They are the perfect weapon for waging total war on insectoids of any kind. Fear will keep the local spiders in line. Fear of the scout handbook. While chasing them around the shelter, we found a misplaced water bottle. Nice! Teddy's not thirsty anymore. Timmy's no, Timmy's no longer thirsty. Oh, we are doing fabulous! It looks like the area is still radioactive. It's still irra irradiated. I cannot read it for the life of me. I barely passed third grade. Going to the waste stand right now is unsafe. Unless you don't mind getting sick. Not yet. I want to wait at least a week. We woke up to a dripping sound today and noticed there's something leaking from the pipes. That green liquid looked innocent enough, even after it ate through the table and the chair and the floor. Patching with that pipe is probably a good idea. What the hell are you gonna use a med kit for? Use the Boy Scout book. I don't care. We're not Boy Scouts. Boy Scouts sucked. I was in it. It was the most miserable time of my life. And look at that! We still got the Boy Scout book! Man, you see, fuck these other two bitches. Like, just me, me and Timmy. Timmy and Ted, best friends for life. Ha, problem solved. No leak, no mess. Back to our tidy little shelter. There's nothing going on with Ted. Nothing new anyways. No news is good news. There's nothing new, new going on with Timmy. Uh, I guess they're good. Our neighborhood is still highly radioactive, so nothing yet. Say we met a bunch of people dressed in what looked like Halloween doctor outfits. They claim to be field hospitals moving from one place to another. Uh, no. What do we look like? Sharing people? Barely shared the shelter with Dolores and Mary Jane. Hey, hey, who drew a dick on the wall? Who drew a dick on the wall? Timmy! Stop drawing dicks! You little dick. We don't think they were real doctors, but just in case they were, we got rid of them quickly before they could start chasing us for a home visit. Charging us for home visit. Where's water when Ted needs it? How about getting Ted, uh, Timmy something to drink? Okay. So still water for the both of them. As one water gone. A neighbor, okay. Still radioactive. We were about to go to sleep when we heard someone knocking on the door. Who could it be at this hour? Or uh, who could it be at this part of the wasteland? How in the hell did they survive the nukes? We no. Might be Dolores. I opened that door. She beats the shit out of me for leaving her in the wasteland. I'm good. The banging stopped after a while, and whoever was behind the door left. We have no idea who it was. We will ne we will we ever find out? Uh, okay, so both hungry, hungry little boys. I mean, fuck, look at Ted. He's always hungry. Uh, we were discussing plans for our first meal that didn't uh, feature tomato soup when we heard yells outside. We discovered they came from a small group of rage survivors. They were a sorry sight, and we weren't surprised when they requested aid. They asked us to provide anything we could: water, food. Can you give them both? Uh, we have, we have more soup, so let's give them soup. They could help us down the road. That has already been a week now, so I'm thinking I'm more comfortable, maybe sending someone out. Oh, we got a radio! Oh hell, you see, being a see, you gotta share. Sharing is caring, and then they share back with you. Unless your name is Dolores or Mary Jane, then as some rapper I don't know the name of, uh, fuck them hoes. Ted is no longer hungry, Timmy's no longer hungry. Okay. Solid. Uh, I'm gonna send. Oh, who do we send? One, two. Computer. Flip a coin. Ted is heads, Timmy is tails. Heads, tails, heads, tails. Tails, Timmy! Can I not choose? Okay. We thought it would be a great idea to have some role-playing fun. Whoa. Ted, are you already missing Dolores? Like, damn, he's your son. We called it Thunderdome. We spent the rest of the day trying to write a script for our performance. We almost got into a fight over it and decided that maybe it would be best to play something simpler. Yeah, because Tim is not the most complex mind. Day nine. Oh, the box is gone, which means we're running out of soup. We played hide and seek. Yeah, where the hell do you think you're going to hide? Where, where, where are you gonna hide? Hide in the cabinet with the broken door? 
Hiding Ted's shirt. Plenty big enough. Uh, Ted needs water. Okay, Timmy can't. Okay, so water. Uh, we'll send Timmy with the gas mask. Can I send both of them? No. I guess we're sending Timmy with the gas mask. He better come back with... What do we want him to come back with? Maybe a map? I mean, we have the radio, which is fine. Maybe... So definitely probably more water and soup. But, like, other than the obvious necessities. I think we have most things. Oh, bullets. Probably bullets or bug spray. That would be the key things. Uh, the map... Remember, for the most part, the map's always outdated. So probably the bullets or the bug spray. Uh, Ted's not thirsty no more. Uh, okay. Let's skip all of that. Because I could barely read past the second grade level. Oh, uh, day is it now? I already forget. Day 11. Fond memories are one thing, but we need to be uh, ready for harsh reality that awaits us. Uh, Ted says there's no need to worry about him. Yeah, I wasn't, gonna, I wasn't worrying about him regardless. Uh, sure, let's use the radio. I swear to God, if it breaks, I'm gonna throw a temper tantrum. What the hell is that? Oh, fell. Damn it! <sighs> damn it, Ted! Oh, damn it. Something blew up inside the radio and then reached, and then, and then the, the wrench thing caught fire. We were able to put it out, but it doesn't work anymore. Ted needs water to survive. Ted is hungry. No, screw you, Ted. You break out radio? One more day without water. What is this? Make contact with the wastelanders. Okay. No, Ted doesn't get anything today. He was a he was a bad boy, bad boy, Ted, bastard. Can't believe you broke a radio. Two days without food. Ted looks like he's got one foot in the grave. He needs. To Damn it. Uh, we can keep sitting on our backsides here in this tiny little bunker, or we could start thinking about getting away at uh, getting away as far as possible from this radioactive wasteland. Who would have thought that the weeds would ruin, that the reds would ruin such a lovely neighborhood? We would do it on our own, the escaping part, not the running part, of course. However, there might be someone out there who could help us. Let's keep. Oh, if only the radio wasn't busted, you dumb bastard. Stop breaking our shit, Ted. Probably ate the radio. God, not feeding you enough? Ted is still hungry. But what? Okay, I guess we have enough soup. Uh, it's high time we stopped running. I, we don't have a radio. Acquire radio to make foot. Damn it! It's always when we need the radio, it's broken. And then when we don't need the radio, oh, magically we'll get another radio. They should have, like, for the react, because this is the reatomized version, they should have made it, like, tools or a toolbox or something to potentially fix, like, the vent or holes or radios, but still make, like, a one-time use. They say ignorance is bliss. Another day without any clue what's going on might not necessarily kill us. Ted isn't hungry anymore. You know, shit, I wasn't gonna give you food. We were about to go to sleep. What do you mean, we? It's just me. Me, myself, and I. Timmy, Timmy, Dolores, dead. Big Bertha, what's her name, Mary Jane? Dead. Timmy, wasteland. We soon discovered it was something much worse. Someone on the other side of the door is trying to get, to shoot them. Oh, we don't have bullets. Let's kill him. Kill, kill, kill. I heard a gunshot though. Oh shit. Some axe actions were enough to send those cowards running. Bet your ass they will be back. Vernon like that are never long gone. They crawl out of the shadows when the night comes. Let's keep our, damn it. Ted's really thirsty, God. There's gonna be nothing left for Timmy when he comes. Our patience is wearing thin, we thought it would be a good idea to take a quick look outside, see if there's any trouble in the area. Uh, as we were about to step out, a pair of animal eyes flashed in the darkness and their owners started growling in the most terrifying way. Uh, sure, but we don't have any bullets. No bullets, is that Timmy? <gasps> Timmy! Did we get more water? Oh, he brought that back, but did, oh, is that a new radio? A quick shot with a rifle was more than enough to scare away or maybe bring down whatever cap creature stalked us in the darkness. We never saw it again. We were so afraid for Timmy, but he came back from the wasteland and is safe with us now. 
Half of our local city has been completely obliterated. The other half, however, looked promising, so we went to investigate the ruins. One of the surviving rooms was a small maintenance closet. Oh my god, look at all this stuff, Timmy. You're amazing! Uh, yeah, Timmy, Timmy, you get, you get it all. Uh, I won't send out yet. A knock on the door is not something we take slightly, would take lightly these days. So when a man came to our doorstep today, offering a highly profitable game of cards, we weren't convinced. Is a better two soup can- No. Timmy worked his ass off- Oh, you know, he didn't get any soup cans. I worked my ass off to get the soup. I take a damn. Ted, you look like garbage. Gambling is a terrible habit. What kind of example is that to set for the kids? For the kids? There's only one kid. Dolores? Dead. Mary Jane? Big Bertha? Dead. We need supplies, but we're not getting them like that. We'd uh, sooner rob some. We'd sooner rob someone. We sent that man away. Good wins. Timmy should eat some. Timmy, I just gave you shit. Now you're starting to push it. No, I don't give you shit. Uh, we had the most cu uh, curious visitors today. One of them was making the sound of a galloping horse using a pair of rocks and hitting them against each other. While his companion was pretending to ride said horse, they claimed to be on a very important quest to seek some magical cup. Only they lost their way to the... W yeah. Dude. Grow up. Bruh. Okay, day 19. Still looking good. Uh, Timmy, sh Timmy, stop! Ah! What else we got? Acquire over Okay, there we go. Uh, Timmy has been sitting there just staring into space. Is something wrong? Maybe it's just a good idea to have a little chat. Yeah. I don't want to send anybody out yet. Maybe like day 25 we'll send Ted out. Or if Timmy's alive and safe, then we'll do that. Uh, Ted needs to rest a bit long. Teddy's no longer hungry, no longer hungry, no longer thirsty. Nice. Uh, uh, as long as we have some food and water, we can stay locked in, but we have to leave eventually. It would be a good idea to head straight to safety instead of getting ourselves into more trouble. If that's even possible in this situation, our hope is that our brave soldiers will come to rescue us and take us to this some well-hidden, well-stocked government shelter. Timmy had comics about those, so you know they must exist. Uh, all we need to do is make contact with Mel to show up. I swear to God, if the radio breaks one more time, all hell will be breaking loose. Maybe? Okay, radio still looks fine. Okay. We made contact. The military is out there and they're coming for us. Okay, sick. All we need to do now is wait patiently. The soldiers with the boring voice was very specific about this. Help is on the way. We just need to sit and wait for further instructions and keep our radio in working order. Timmy has stars invested. Ted is fine. Okay. Uh, still not sent anyone yet. The last time we went on expedition, we noticed some abandoned tank just sitting there out in the open. It looks damaged, but it may continue useful support. Ah, uh, no. I, I don't want to risk it yet. Okay, we got a telephone. Damn. Timmy looks. Fucked. We decided against going for ins uh, inspection of the tank for all we know it might be a trap or simply a burnt out wreck Not worth our time and effort. Tim doesn't drink anything. He won't last long. Timmy is rested. Tim uses me much. Okay, so water for both of them uh, Yeah, okay now we're fine Knocking is that No, we said. I'm pretty sure we said it with the radio. Uh, Ted is hungry. Ted is hungry. We give Ted that. There's an armed and dangerous woman outside. Fortunately, she's out of ammo. She tells us she hunts the wild beast at the waste. We don't got shit for you. Damn, that sucks. Is she still knocking? Like, leave us alone. Oh, t Timmy drew someone else. Where the hell are you getting markers from? Better be your own piss and urine. What am I? So what? What do I do in the case that they're fatigued? Should I just give them both water then? I suppose. 
Uh, I'll go one more day without. Offers one soup in exchange for, uh, four waters. Ah, no, none of that's good. I don't want to trade anything with anybody. Especially, like, we have pretty good stuff. I don't want to deal with any of that now. Whoa, what happened to our soup? Oh, I guess we just used it all. Damn. Damn. Wow, okay. All right, I forgot. Uh, Timmy should eat something. Sure, Timmy, you can have food. Uh, yeah, we'll prepare. Okay, well, we don't have anything. They offer, oh, a map for a gun. Oh, no, that's all shit. I'm not, I, I don't even, I'm not even reading those stuff, because I can't read. Day 26. Realistic, I should put, oh, I don't know. Because I don't, I, I might have to send Timmy out thinking about it now. Tennessee's, uh, even though, uh, was gonna shoot. You know what? No, I'll send, I'll send Ted out. Wait, what did he need? She needs something, okay. I'll give him both something. Uh, let's give him, uh, uh yeah, yeah, Okay. I think just since yesterday, it feels ready to go now. Who should be the lucky one? But what should we give him? Gun, ah, uh, we'll give, we'll give him the gas mask. Why is this, what to do, unavailable, what? Okay. It's a bit odd. So Ted's heading out to do his thing to chill out, well, no, he's heading out. We got Timmy over here, chilling out Max and relaxing all cool. Ted left for the, sur for the surface, we'll hope you'll be back. It'll be funny in this instance, like, the whole journals Ted was writing, and when Ted leaves, like, Whoever else is in the um, uh, is in the bunker, so like it would be Dolores, then Mary Jane, then Timmy. But in this case, it would be Timmy, and he would write it, and it would be like gibberish and shit. I think it'd be funny. Uh, I think about nothing. Okay, so give him some water. A sleazy-looking trader carrying an equally scuffy bag on his shoulder paid us a visit. He uh, he offered us a simple one-time deal for just one can of soup. We can get the bag and we'll contain it for what's inside. Oh, you see, this is a terrible. I really shouldn't do this, but I kind of want to because I think I know what it is. Yep, yep. <gasps> it's a kitty cat! <laughs> I mean, mind you, we're fucked on food now. Uh, as soon as the door closed behind him, the, tr uh, the bag started shut. Yeah, 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 yeah. Timmy's no longer thirsty. Good. The other day, we heard a quiet knock on the door, and we opened it. We found a suitcase on the doorstep, and there was no one around. It isn't signed, but it looks like that was meant for us. We, I mean, what else are we supposed to do? It's a fucking bomb. Day 29. What do we got? Did we get another soup? Another soup can? Oh, okay, sick. Okay. Awesome. So we got the soup can. So basically, we got the cat, cat, kitty cat for free. Uh, uh, Timmy's on his best behavior. Okay. Uh... It became more and more difficult to breathe in the shelter over the last couple of hours. We suspect there was something wrong with the ventilation. Maybe it got stuck somehow, but how? We need to investigate. Sure. Sure, use the book. Don't let the book break. I mean, the book's probably going to break. We're not going to have the book anymore. Oh, no. See, oh, my God. Our luck is unreal. Uh, okay. Timmy should drink. Oh, okay. You see, I don't want to use the med kit because then I know for a fact. T oh, no. Ted has a... Uh, gas mask. So technically speaking, he shouldn't need the med kit. Uh, we were able to catch the military broadcast again. This time they're telling, they're asking us to get out with, to get out with the flashlight and signal. <sighs> of course, we don't have a flashlight. Son of a bitch. Ted better come back with a flashlight. Son of a bitch. Okay, so Timmy looks better, but there goes our med kit. Timmy, okay, Timmy is cured. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, I guess we'll give him some water for now. We're trying the, to pet the little devil. We found a piece of paper on his collar with an address scrib uh, scribbled on it. Could it, uh, could its previous owner still be around and void with sickness? Uh, now normally, I'm gonna say yes. Oh, because I'm pretty sure the cat always comes back. Okay. Someone trying to talk to us. 
Oh, little Pompadou's gone. We grabbed a new fluffy fan for a little stroll through the wasteland, only to immediately run into a couple of gentlemen dressed in trench coats, fedoras and shades. They gritted their teeth at the sight of the cat, and they've been looking for it. Apparently, it belongs to their dead old man, who loves it dearly. Before we could utter a word, they took Shaw Shaw Cove. Oh, that's what the name of it. Thanked us and left. Aw. Timmy's hungry. Ling, 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 there, uh, there, there, there we were, thinking we could never hear a telephone again, when suddenly a phone starts ringing from somewhere outside the shelter. We figured, oh, yeah, 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 let's go check it out. Okay, nothing. We, uh, when we answered the phone, we could clearly hear a gasp of relief from the caller. They introduced themselves as survivors from a nearby town of Hill Valley. When we started uh, exchanging information, when the call was cut short, something must have gone wrong on their side. We hope they get back to us. Okay, Timmy is very hungry. Timmy, stop eating! You're gonna turn into Ted. Well, we got nothing to do with it, so I'm never gonna bother eating it, because there's no point. <gasps> is Ted back? Holy shit, Ted! Look at all the shit you got! No, none of the med kit? More soup, more water, I think, and bug spray, which is good, and a map. Hell yeah. Gas mask is back. More soup, more water, a map, and a uh, bug spray. Timmy is very hungry. Timmy prefers apple juice, but right now, uh, so, uh, we'll give him both the stuff. Uh, I, oh, wait, is Timmy sick again? Timmy isn't feeling very well. Timmy, bro! Well, we, we got nothing for you, bud. They offered flashlight for a harmonica. They offered an axe for a checkerboard. Ooh, we could use an axe. So I'm gonna give him the checkerboard. You see, and Shokov is back. Oh, what a nice little kitty. There we go. Ted, uh, Ted, uh, Ted is looking very. Oh, Timmy, 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 Timmy. I still might be tired. Needs more time to recover his strength. Did he need anything? Oh, Ted is hungry. Okay, let's give Ted some food. Uh, I'm not sending anybody else yet out yet. Uh, we've discussed everything and we could, and no one is willing to chat anymore. The silence is really disturbing. Ugh. I'm gonna regret this because I know it's gonna break, and if it breaks, don't even get me started. It's not broken. Okay. Ah, uh, how fortunate. We took with the uh, the radio with us. We can probably listen to some music. They still play music out there, didn't they? Uh, hungry, hungry. Okay. Damn, we are running out of soup. Uh, a loud crash, a surprise shriek, and a bit of debris falling from our ceiling. Truly a recipe for a good start to the day. As it turns out, she co-found a new toy. Uh, a bit of... Wiring that ripped out of the wall. Who knows what the cable's for? But our lights are still on, so it can't be that important, right? She would take the wire from our fluffy friend. Nah. That's hers now. She claimed it. It's hers. She owns it, not us. Day 37. Oh, for a second. I didn't see her there. I was like, no way the wire killed the cat. <laughs> now she's alive. Friendly. Well, friendly, a little. For the line that's alive. The wire's probably useless. Timmy's looking very pale. That's good. Timmy's no longer hungry. Uh, some water, water, uh, where's water? Okay. Water we still got a decent bit of. Is he still feeling ill? Yeah. But the gas mask is still solid. Ever since we jumped into our fallout shelter, we've been uh, wondering about the other door in the shelter. Yeah, let's go check it out. Bullets went flying. And the gun's still alive. Okay. And we got water out of it? What the hell? Okay. Uh, I'm gonna wait for day 40 to go out to the shelter. So I'll get ready on day 39. It's not the best time or place to make plans for the future. But we can't help thinking about what we... Okay. Wait, how? What else? Signal? Okay. I'll wait for the instructions. Okay. So we desperately need a flashlight. That's, that's the only reason why I want to send him out more. 
And one more time is either for more soup, but mostly for a flashlight. Ted is hungry. Timmy's still uh, qu uh, quite sickly. Give him some food and we'll start preparing. Uh, first aid kit is of no use and we need to do something about it. For some bizarre reason, we believe we could use a lethal bug spray to produce some additional medicine. Sure. Okay. I was waiting for one of them to be dead. Oh, we have a med kit. Okay. Ted is hungry. Ted, uh, drink. Uh, drink. Okay. Both some drinks. Well, yeah, we have a lot of water now. Uh, does one of them need the med kit? Timmy needs the med kit. I'm gonna wait a, uh, a few more days. I uh, will send Ted out. Uh, what should we give him? Uh, you know, we'll give him the gas mask only because I can't afford to get him sick. I was gonna ha send him out with, uh, the axe or the gun, but I can't afford him to get him sick because I need to save Timmy. So we'll send him out. And then hopefully he comes back with a flashlight. Okay. Uh, Timmy should eat. There we go. Timmy. Damn it, we don't have anything. Shit. See, we, we desperately need that flashlight. If we get the flashlight, we'll, we'll survive. Uh oh, uh, knocking. That's not good. We get bullets. What? Uh, there's no signal. Uh, she probably ran face first into a wall. Okay. Timmy's on hungry. That's fine. We woke into probably crazy alleged scientists into our shelter today. Turns out Shakov is not only an, uh, an incredible, ill-mannered pet, but also the scientist's highly valued assistant from who he calls Dr. Shorikov. The cat's appearance has left the doctor struggling with the, with his latest project. He's expecting us to help him out as a uh, compensation for keeping his helper away. What? We're not keeping his helper away. She came to us. Don't you ever forget that. Is that more knocking on the door? Go away! Damn, like, leave me alone. Yeah, wow, this, we've come to just this. Uh, Timmy should drink. Uh, we, uh, we always stayed away from casinos, gamp, sure, we'll play cards. Okay. I'm just waiting for Ted to come back. For the most part, for the next couple of days, we're probably just gonna skip a bunch. Okay, we got water. How the hell do we get water? Uh, I'll give him that and that, and then we'll send Timmy out. So that he'll be, uh, what? Wait, wait, what? Die in your shelter? We didn't die in the shelter. What do you mean? <gasps> oh, Ted died? Fuck! <laughs> what will we eat today? Wait, we can't... Oh, that's actually the end? Son of a bitch. How did Timmy last longer than Ted? Look at him. Look at his delusional ass. You perished, son of a bitch. Day survived 45. Water's consumed 6... Uh, 6.75. Soup's consumed 4.75. Time's defended your shelter once... Successful expeditions, two out of three. Items bought from expeditions, seven. No decisions, two. And yes decisions, three. Welp, uh, survived 45 days on the, on the boys only. Good old camping trip. Uh, was this a successful boys trip? Probably not. Should we try this again soon? With a girl's trip, uh, hopefully not, but you'll let me know in the comment section below. Get this video to 10 likes and we'll do a girl's only survival run. I'm not looking forward to that.